South Korean police are looking for two men who are allegedly part of a plot to install spy cameras in voting booths. Secret recording devices were found in 40 locations. Voting in parliamentary elections will start on Thursday. 영어 청취 가랑비 귀뚜라미 영어 오늘의 공부를 시작합니다. The U.S. government has asked the space agency NASA to devise a unified standard of time for the moon. The White House said it was vital to set international norms as nations and private companies race to establish a more permanent lunar presence. Question. Who asked whom to devise a unified standard of time for the moon? The U.S. government has asked the space agency NASA to devise a unified standard of time for the moon. The White House said it was vital to set international norms as nations and private companies race to establish a more permanent lunar presence. The U.S. government has asked the space agency NASA to devise a unified standard of time for the moon. The White House said it was vital to set international norms as nations and private companies race to establish a more permanent lunar presence. 미국 정부는 나사에 달에 대한 통일된 시간 기준을 고안해 줄 것을 요청했습니다. 백악관은 여러 국가와 민간 기업들이 달에 상주하기 위해 경쟁함에 따라 국제적인 표준을 정하는 것이 중요하다고 말했습니다. The U.S. government has asked the space agency NASA to devise a unified standard of time for the moon. The White House said it was vital to set international norms as nations and private companies race to establish a more permanent lunar presence. The U.S. government has asked the space agency NASA to devise a unified standard of time for the moon. The White House said it was vital to set international norms as nations and private companies race to establish a more permanent lunar presence. The U.S. government has asked the space agency NASA to devise a unified standard of time for the moon. The White House said it was vital to set international norms as nations and private companies race to establish a more permanent lunar presence. Devise, to invent something new, 뭔가 새로운 것을 발명하거나, or a new way of doing something, 새로운 방법을 고안하다라는 의미가 되겠습니다. A new system has been devised to control traffic in the city, 도시의 교통을 통제하기 위해 새로운 시스템이 고안되었습니다. Vital, necessary or essential, 필요하거나 주요한 거죠, in order for something, 뭔가가 to succeed or exist, 지속하거나 존재하는데, 필수적인이라는 의미가 되겠고요. 또 다른 의미는 connected with 연결되었거나 or necessary 필요한 거죠. for staying alive 예, 삶을 유지하는데 생명과 직결된이라는 의미도 있고요. of a person 사람에 대해서 얘기할 때는 full of energy and enthusiasm 활력이 넘친다라는 의미도 되겠습니다. patience and cool head are vital for investors 하게 되면 인내심과 냉철함은 투자자에게 아주 중요합니다. Norm, a situation, 어떤 상황이죠. Or a pattern of behavior, 어떤 행동 양식입니다. That is usual or expected, 정상적으로 생각되고 예상이 되어지는 규범이라는 의미가 되겠고요. Norms라고 복수로 주로 쓰이게 되는데요. Standard of behavior, 어떤 행동 규범, 행동 양식입니다. That is typical, 일반적이거나 Or accepted, 받아들여지는 거죠. Within a particular group or society, 특정 단체나 어떤 사회에서 정상 표준이라는 의미가 되겠습니다. Small families are the norm nowadays. 하게 되면 요즘은 소규모 가족이 일반적입니다. Lunar 장음이 되겠습니다. Connected with the moon 달과 관련이 된 A lunar eclipse 하게 되면 월식이 되겠고요. Lunar calendar 하면 음력이 되겠죠. Lunar new year 하게 되면 음력으로 새해가 되겠습니다. The US government has asked the space agency NASA 미국 정부는 미 항공 우주국 나사에 요청했습니다. To devise a unified standard of time for the moon. 달과 관련해 통일된 시간 기준을 고안해 줄 것을. The White House said, 백악관은 말했습니다. It was vital to set international norms. 국제적인 표준을 정하는 것이 아주 중요하다고. As nations and private companies race. 
국가와 일반 기업들이 경쟁을 해감에 따라 To establish a more permanent lunar presence 좀더 달에 상주하기 위해 The White House 하면 백악관이죠 이것은 바로 미국 정부를 의미하겠습니다 It was vital to set international norms 국제적인 표준을 정하는 것이 중요합니다 이 투영 보이죠? 가주어 진주어 이시 가리키는 것은 투 이하가 되겠습니다 To establish a more permanent lunar presence 직역을 하게 되면 더 영구적인 달의 존재를 구축하기 위해인데요 의역을 하게 되면 달에 상주하기 위해 또는 달을 선점하기 위해 라고 할수 있겠습니다 The US government has asked the space agency NASA to devise a unified standard of time for the moon. The White House said it was vital to set international norms as nations and private companies race to establish a more permanent lunar presence. The US government has asked the space agency NASA The US government has asked the space agency NASA The US government has asked the space agency NASA to devise a unified standard of time for the moon to devise a unified standard of time for the moon to devise a unified standard of time for the moon the us government has asked the space agency nasa to devise a unified standard of time for the moon the us government has asked the space agency nasa to devise a unified standard of time for the moon The U.S. government has asked the space agency NASA to devise a unified standard of time for the moon. The White House said, the White House said, the White House said, that it was vital to set international norms, that it was vital to set international norms, that it was vital to set international norms, as nations and private companies race, as nations and private companies race, as nations and private companies race. to establish a more permanent lunar presence to establish a more permanent lunar presence to establish a more permanent lunar presence the white house said it was vital to set international norms as nations and private companies race to establish a more permanent lunar presence the white house said it was vital to set international norms as nations and private companies race to establish a more permanent lunar presence The White House said it was vital to set international norms as nations and private companies race to establish a more permanent lunar presence. 오늘의 뉴스는 미국 정부가 많은 나라와 기업들이 달에 상주하기 위해 경쟁하는 가운데 미 항공 우주국의 달 시간에 관한 표준을 고안할 것을 요청했다는 소식이었습니다. 다시 한번 들으시면서 오늘의 공부를 마무리하시기 바랍니다. The US government has asked the space agency NASA to devise a unified standard of time for the moon. The White House said it was vital to set international norms as nations and private companies race to establish a more permanent lunar presence. The US government has asked the space agency NASA to devise a unified standard of time for the moon. The White House said it was vital to set international norms as nations and private companies race to establish a more permanent lunar presence. Question. Who asked whom to devise a unified standard of time for the moon? Today, 시청해 주셔서 감사합니다.